Vox Project Two Column Notes, Section 4. This short video is going to review cutting rabbits in your top. But remember, everything you see here is going to be covered in your step by step plan of procedure. To start, you're going to clamp up your box like Photo 5. Go back to the dado saw and set the height of the cutter head. Next, set the fence. Only one half inch of the cutter head should be exposed from the wooden fence. Now it's time to get the instructor, who's going to model how to safely complete this step. Once everything has been checked that it's set up correctly, you're going to use a push pad to run your top across the grain first. Notice the push pad is not over the cutter head and the left hand is just kind of helping hold the board against the fence. Once you've gone across the grain, then go on the two sides with the grain. The hope is, is that once it's set up, the rabbit will be cut in all four sides of your top and that it'll fit in your clamped up box that is sitting right next to you. In this case, it doesn't fit, so adjustments need to be made. With the tool off, you're going to tap the fence away from the cutter head a little bit. This will expose more of the cutter head, meaning cutting your rabbit a little wider on all four sides. Same process here. Go across the grain first and then with the grain. Once you've completed all four sides on this setup, try your top and see if it fits in your clamped up box. This concludes the short review video of section four of your two column notes. Let's get back in the shop and let's get back to building.